Surprise! Guys, finally, dumating ang aking mga binili nung Lazada birthday sale. And everything I bought is from the Razer official store in the Philippines. And I'm really excited. No? I got a big, huge discount nung birthday sale nila. No? And I'm ready to turn my gaming around and make my table, my gaming table, into a Razer theme. And lahat isisync natin via Chroma. And I'm very excited. Are you? Tara, samahan niyo ako. So hi guys, ako pala si Richman ng Gadget Psychic and welcome back to my channel. So kita natin on my table, sobrang dami. I probably naubos ang aking pera sa kakabili na mga stuff from Razer. And hindi ako nagsisisi. I know Razer is world-class gaming mga, uh, devices here, gadgets. I know that this is the choice of great gamers out there throughout the world. And starting off with this one, the Razer Black Widow Mini Hyperspeed na 65% wireless mechanical gaming keyboard. Ako personally, I don't really like wired na keyboard kasi ang daming nakakala sa table and it's a bit messy. Para wireless, ang ganda tingnan, malinis sa yung table, walang wire. Yun nga lang, of course, sometimes sabi nila, your gaming might be compromised dahil baka malag or, or whatsoever. But I believe that this one is a game changer. And meron din ako dito is the Dead Adder X Hyperspeed na wireless gaming mouse. Like again, tulad ng aking keyboard, ayaw ko na may wire, so tinry ko ito. And basa ko dito sa gilid, sabi ng mga expert dito, no? Still the best gaming mouse when it comes to comfort. Sabi ni S4. Ito yung mga, ito yung mga, ano yun, no? mga champions sa kanya-kanyang mga category, no? In terms of gaming. And I believe what they say. So gusto ko rin itry, no? Kung totoo nga ba itong mga pinagsasabi nila, pinapiprint nila dito sa gilid or just pure advertisement? Malalaman natin. And of course, to add some excitement to our gaming, bumili rin tayo nito. Itong si Wolverine V2 na wired gaming controller which is designed mainly for Xbox pero pwede natin itong gamitin sa ating PC to, well, play those games like NBA, 2K, and of course, siguro some shooting games. Gusto natin itry kung gano'ng ka-okay nga ba to Or probably some RPG games. And I'm sure, kasi pag nasa keyboard ka, medyo nakakangawit pag RPG. But this one, it's really designed for gaming. Probably one of my favorite gaming headset na gusto ko itry, this is the Kraken V3 Hypersense with haptic technology from Razer. And I, I think itong design na to, no, is pretty cool. And... Of course, meron pa siya microphone kung gusto mo mag, ano, mag may kausap ka during gaming. It's pretty good. And yeah, I heard that this is very comfy sa tenga. So yeah, let's give it a try. And of course, syempre gusto natin mag, mag try maging streamer naman for some time. And we have here is the Razer Siren X na condensed streaming microphone. So, hindi lang siguro ito pang condense. Probably, we can record some of our videos using this one. And, try natin. I'll be trying to use this in some of my videos in the coming days. Ito try natin kung gano'ng ka-okay siya ang sound nito. Kung masusurpress ba niya mga ingay. And, kaya ba niyang i-cancel lahat ng echo dito sa aking room. Na, hinahanap-hanap ko, no? On microphones na hindi ko pa rin matama. Of course, siyempre, it's probably one of the problems here in my studio is the echo. Hopefully, this one can solve my problem. Ito, siguro one of my good investment dito sa binili ko, no? Is the Razer Base Station Chroma na USB headset na stand. Pang, pang sabi ko na headset. Plus, may Chroma siya sa ilalim. And meron pa siyang dalawang USB port nandiyan sa ilalim. And I'm sure na I'll be plugging in this one. Together with this one, just as base station na ito. And I'm excited. And the final product nandito sa aking table from Razer, of course, is the Goliathus Extended Chroma na sobrang haba na RGB gaming mousepad. No? And it's really, uh, isa sa mga hinahanap ko talaga, i-fill up yung table ko. Then merong, ano, may, may color, may ilaw border ko. And it's connected through Razer Chroma RGB. And I'm sure lahat to pwede natin connect using the Razer Chroma RGB to make our gaming experience to a whole new level. 
So I'm really excited in mount to sa aking table and ratian natin ko ano yung ba ng aking bagong gaming setup.
ayun guys, nakita nyo na ang aking simple na setup dito sa aking table. So, starting off with yung keyboard, yung razor, ang mouse, wireless mouse, gaming mouse, and of course, ang aking favorite na controller is here. Then, si Siren X nandito, it's going, uh, going to be used during my live streams. Then, of course, Osbot nandyan din together with itong Kraken na Hypersense is definitely going to be nice. And of course, ang yung aking stand na may dalawang USB port. You know, yung uh, headphones holder ko, lahat nandito na. And of course, don't forget yung aking mat is also here. May RGB din siya. Okay? It's really nice to have a very nice na razor setup dito sa aking table. And I'm really privileged to be able to do this with the help of Razer Philippines. I'm really thankful. Guys, and of course, papakita ko sa inyo no, kung paano gamitin nga ba ng maayos tong mga peripherals ko dito na lahat made from Razer. And of course, guys, ang monitor ko right now is the LG Ultra Wide 34-inch na monitor. Sobrang laki nito. I'm really surprised na ang laki nito. I mean, ako being a ano, uh, full-time day job na person, I always use the spreadsheet a lot. So, pinaka-problem ko sa office ang aking spreadsheet kasi ang aking monitor is just 22-inch. I, I think it's just a 22-incher. So, isang window lang nakamuha. So, one of my biggest problem is pag kailangan ko tumingin inter dalawa o tatlong spreadsheet, I need to go down to the taskbar, pipindog pa ako. Ang hirap. But with this one, grabe, tatlong, ano, no, tatlong spreadsheet. Kayang-kaya mo makita dito in just one screen. It's really nice, very productive. Lalo na pag nagmumultitasking ka, probably one of the best device no, na monitor na ma-advise ko sa inyo, get the LG Ultra Wide 34-inch monitor. I'm sure if you're a multitasker like me, may enjoy na to. Content creating, photo editing, lahat kaya-kaya na gawin. Kahit gaming, sisyong-sisyo dito. Alam later, papakita ko sa inyo no, yung mga ibang uh, things na pwede mo magawa dito sa monitor to, si LG 34-inch Ultra Wide monitor. And right now, let's just focus dito kay Razer. So, na-install ko na si Razer Central. So guys, nakita na na-install ko na ang Razer Central. So, everything's already here being installed. Ang aking base station, ang aking mouse, ang aking keyboard, ang desk mat, and of course, ang aking headphones. Everything's here. And to my surprise, lahat sila is in perfect harmony. Kita nyo ang colors. It's going to sync the same, oh. Tinan mo, yung colors sila by the Razer Chroma, pati ito, sabay. So, mga sabay sa color. It's really nice. Ang ganda ng pagka-unity nila. Ang sarap tingnan, no? Yeah. Kahit si keyboard, color blue din. So, mga sabay din. It's really nice. Okay? So, if you have the chance na mag-invest, I highly suggest na bumili kayo ng something like this. It's really a worth investment. So, pa nagpo-flow yung color, pare-pare sila. Perfect. Hard. So guys, sisimula muna natin dito sa keyboard ni Razer. And I want to show you na okay, na okay itong keyboard na ito. Be it for gaming, for working. Except siguro para sa akin, kulang lang sa akin isa ng pad. But of course, pwede naman bumili extension ng attachment for that. Not a big deal. Since uh, ako, it's either hybrid kasi ako. Either I use it for gaming or for working. So itong keyboard ni Razer deploys the Razer Yellow Switch. As kita natin dito, pagtanggal natin ng keycap. The Razer Yellow Switch na deployed dito sa Razer na keyboard is very fast ang kanya actuation. Just 1.2 mm fast actuation. It's perfect for gaming. Ang feel nito is linear and of course quiet din siya. The actuation force just need 45 grams para mag-actuate. Then of course ang kanya traveling distance is 3.5 mm, very very small. And of course uh, halos ano no, halos very minimal ang actuation versus reset point niya at 0.0 mm. Grabe. So brown fast nito, lalo when you're gaming, it's really nice. And even if you're typing, okay, so I just try to what type lang tayo, no? the quick brown fox. Very, very fast ang kanya, no? ang kanyang actuation, uh, giving me the very nice feeling dito, especially when you're typing, especially when you're uh, doing your spreadsheet. Okay naman siya. The only thing na kulang sa akin is probably a numpad at the side. But of course, I can always buy it on the side. That is not a big problem. What's important sa akin is very smooth ang ano na aking performance sa aking keyboard. And when I and you can also use two modes here. 
either you go for a wireless switch or of course your Bluetooth. Uh, right now, I'm using the wireless, so definitely uh, mas mabilis dapat, okay? So you can also use wired if you want using this cable, a uh, USB Type-C, but of course, uh, that's during gaming. But on regular usage, I prefer having it wireless. And if you want uh, a little bit higher, pwede mo angat to para medyo mas matasan yung feel. Depende sa inyo, okay? So, sa akin, perfect na yung nakalapa. So, ganun. Okay na okay na sa akin to. Now, let's talk about the mouse dito. So, this mouse, uh, tinry ko siya sa gaming and it's really responsive. So, I did play a quick games of Call of Duty and some uh, games like Valorant. And I can see yung kanyang gaming experience is definitely nice. And of course, what I like about this one is very light siya. And it's ergonomically made just for gaming. Itong Razer na mouse. And you can always use either um, Bluetooth mode or your wireless mode. So, ako, I prefer using it sa ano, no, wireless mode. So, naka-plug lang ang USB sa aking PC to make sure na mas panganda ang connection. Walang interruption. Okay? Dedicated and dedicated. So, these mga buttons dito, kaya pwede mo configure sa Razer Snaps. So, it's easy. Siguro probably di kulang lang dito sa akin. For me, ah, is yung uh, RGB lights. Para maging chroma, para maging uniform sila lahat. But overall, I can see okay na okay itong mouse na to. I love using it. I've been already using this for roughly two weeks already here. And I can see na I love it. I already ditched my older mouse in the place of this one. So I can't really wait na palitan. Kasi ang ganda. Ang ganda ng kanyang uh, feel dito sa aking table. And right now, let's move over dito sa gaming controller ni Razer. So I can say that this one is almost similar to that of the Xbox. So hindi pwede mong gamitin sa Xbox dahil I think license naman to to manufacture to mga uh, gaming controllers for Xbox. But you can also use it for PC na usage. No? So I can see yung kanyang grip it's uh, almost the same sa Xbox. I previously had the uh, Xbox One. So, alam po anong sure ng kanyang keyboard. So, these are yung mga pang navigation. Then, of course, uh, these uh, have some other function. May RB, RT, okay? So, M2, and dito lahat. So, lalo when you're playing some shooting games, this is definitely something na gusto mong gamitin. Like, or mga fighting games. It's uh, going to be very helpful. Dahil uh, when you're fighting, minsan gigil na gigil ka. It's going to be faster playing it here than playing on the keyboard. And I can see yung grip niya is nice. And uh, hindi siya slippery. Made out of yung fabric niya, no? yung materials niya. Uh, hindi siya smooth. It's quite rough uh, for nice gripping dito sa gaming. No? And upon pressing this X button ni Xbox, makita natin lalabas tong Welcome to Xbox Game Bar. So, you just simply have to configure it here to be able to use it uh, properly sa inyong uh, gaming. So guys, this is how yung Osbot would be able to perform dito sa, I don't know, sa, of course, sa, when you're recording some videos over here. Uh, it has auto AI tracking which tracks me wherever I go and it's really cute. And I can also do it manually like this one, okay? So, it's going to go around my studio just like this. And it's kind of making me dizzy. So, that's how it is. This is the Osmo Tiny. Very nice device. Probably the first ever in the market having a gimbal, having a auto tracking to our webcam. It's really something that is very innovative. And I love it. This is the Osmo Tiny. So guys, right now, I'm recording using this Razer Siren X and I just want to try it out kung okay nga ba tong sounds uh, when I use this for live streaming if uh, I'll be further using this for recording some videos on my desktop and I think this is going to be a very nice mic since it's a condensed mic it should cancel all the noise around me giving me that nice sound without the background noise and I think this is enough to show you that this mic definitely is good. So right now, I'm going to put on this Razer Kraken V3 with Hypersense. So I'll be listening to some of the audios. Uh, and of course, first stop, I can see that it's really snug fit. And the cable is quite long, so I can extend it. There's no problem with it. So the RGB is being connected to Razer Chroma, meaning it's being synced together with all the other Razer stuff I have here on my table. 
the color is nice, the smooth color, the flowing colors with the RGB really makes it eye candy to my eyes. I love it. And of course, right now, I'm going to play some music. So after listening to the recording that I made with the Siren X together with the Ospot, I can say that this is being able to play it really smooth. And listening to audios on Spotify, playing some games, this Razer Quaker V3 definitely just nailed it. It's really nice and I love it. Everything about this one is really smooth to my ears. It's not uh, itchy. There are some other uh, headphones when you use it for a long period of time. You can feel that it's really hot and it's really you want to just simply take it off this one i can probably wear it for half of the day playing games right now we're going to try to play a game here using all of these razor peripherals i have on my table so we'll be trying to feel the game if it's immersive it's, uh how my expectation would be for this kind of setup Now, for the LG 34-inch ultra-wide monitor, I can say that it's really wide. I love it since it's giving me that perfect view, be it for gaming, for watching movies, or just simply doing my spreadsheet, or just simply watching movies. Enjoying the night off here, uh, having this LG ultra-wide 34-inch monitor is definitely one of the best experience I have. And I do highly suggest that you purchase one of these if you're looking for a monitor that's 34-inch wide and it gives you the best viewing angle possible and the price is just right and if you want to know also where you can buy this lg ultra wide monitor 34 inch i'll just pop it on the description box below so after playing with these peripherals playing the call of duty 
uh, here on my PC, I can say that this keyboard really responded really nice. Since it has the Razer yellow keys, the response is fast and I love it. And of course, the mouse is equally fast. The response rate is quite fast. Every click I made is really nice. And of course, having this Razer uh, mouse mat over here did help because it is made simply to game together with this Razer mouse that I have. And of course, I can say that the Siren X has a pretty nice sound, especially really nice for streaming. The Osprot is especially well, and I love the way that it handles uh, the video, especially. Uh, I just simply need to calibrate it a little bit more, but overall, I was able to use it to uh, record some video. Uh, pretty soon, I'll be using it on live stream, so stay tuned for more of that. And of course, the stand here is pretty much useful, especially having two USB port down there is especially very helpful, and I love it since I can simply place my favorite headphones over here, which is the Kraken V3 with Hypersense, and it just simply sits there pretty well. And it's pretty much of a Razer setup here on my table, and, and if you want to have similar setup like this one, I'll be popping everything on the description box below, just check it out. And of course, if you like this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and of course, click that bell icon to the miss any future videos here from my channel. And pretty soon I'll be mounting this one, the Yeelight LED screen. And what I like is that it has Razer Chroma together with this one. So I'll be able to sync all of the RGB together with this one. Simply perfect. And so I'm Richmond and you're watching Gadget Psychic. What's up?